Good morning. It is a beautiful day outside today. It was not rainy, but I kind of, I really miss the rain and the um, just chilling down. It is pretty hot today. Like it feels like a really good day to go to the pool, but it's a Thursday. So um, today I have my gym class today, so I'm gonna be going to that. I am working all day long, um, just getting a lot of things done for work. So right now I am about to find something for lunch and then get back to it. Um, yeah. <sighs> Again, just not quite, I didn't get ready yet today because I'm just gonna jump right into my gym clothes, go to the gym, and then I come back and take a shower and stuff like that. So, kind of, whenever I take a shower before the gym, it's like, oh, I just wasted a shower. So it's like, uh, do I do it that now? And just wait. So, yeah, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Um, I am, Hoping that you really enjoyed yesterday's vlog and some of the different things that we've done or that I've done as far as um, editing. One of the things that I want to do is, you know, the beginning it was just, you know, I say the beginning, but it's only been, what, almost two weeks? I think two weeks, maybe, of uh, daily vlogging, vlogging every day, picking up the camera and saying something to it um, at some point every day. Um, even though I, I skipped two days of uploads um, while I was in New York, but I did pick up the camera, which I feel like was an accomplishment for me. I mean, one thing I noticed throughout this experience too is just how much we're really enjoying, you know, living in the moment and kind of focusing on the activities that we're doing together um, as a family um, with, you know, me and Ryan. So, if anything, I feel like this has just created a, a stronger bond between us, maybe? I guess, I don't know if I'm getting all philosophical or something on you. I don't know. I don't know what the word for it would be, but um, really, just really enjoying, you know, having having a reason to want to get up and do something rather than just sit and chill, which you know, we still we still sit and chill, which we, we need that downtime, but at the same time, it's just been really nice to be able to say, okay, you know, enough with the sitting around and, you know, not doing anything. What can we do to be more active in our lives? Since I do have a very sedentary job, I sit on the computer pretty much all day. Um, one of the things I want to do more of, which, um, I think tomorrow I don't have too many calls, so I want I want to try. I know I said this before. I wanted to go to the library um, earlier this week and work there, but you know, Gary's barking outside. <laughs> One of the things I wanted to do is go to the library and work in a new location and just maybe ride my bike over to the library, or maybe ride my bike to a coffee shop or something like that. Riding my bike to somewhere nearby. Luckily, we live in an area that. You know, there's quite a few things nearby that I, I can ride my bike to, so, and it's not, it's not a ridiculous amount. Walking might be, take a really long time, but bike, biking won't take as long, so I won't really miss as much of my day. It'd just be my quick little transit. Um, but yeah, I want to get out of the house more. It's, you know, as I said, I have a very sedentary job. Sitting on the computer is all day long is really bad for you. I don't have one of those stand-up desks at home. Um, the rest of my team is not in Colorado Springs, they're in Denver, so and that's that's quite a drive. I don't think I'd ever want to do that commuting thing. I've never been good at commuting, so I just don't. When I need to, I go, but usually I don't. So um, it's just easier to work from home. I'm super blessed to be able to work from home and super happy about that, so. Um, I, I enjoy, especially days where I have lots of calls or when they're first thing in the morning, stuff like that. But yeah, I feel like I'm rambling right now. So I'm going to find something to eat and then get back to it. Probably take a walk around the house for a little bit. Um, yeah. And then, 
yeah, I'll catch up with you later. We're, I'm going to the gym. I've got to figure out, I think I want to leave some notes for Ryan on making some stuffed poblano peppers maybe for dinner, but I might give him some notes on to, how to do it or I'll just have him wait until I get home so he doesn't have to worry about it. So yeah, I will chat with you a little bit later. Bye. Oh, you poor thing. This is what I do to you. <laughs> Doesn't it look like he has a bonnet on? Oh, you're so adorable. Oh, isn't it funny? He says, no, Mom, it's not that funny. Mom, just hold me. Come on. Come on. Oh, he always does this. You're so sweet. I love you. Oh, I know. Here. He always jumps up to be held like a baby. Yes, oh, you are a baby. Oh, oh. Coda, do you wish you could be held? I know. Only daddy can hold you, though. I can't pick you up. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, pretty girl. Yeah, she's a pretty girl. What are you doing? <laughs> she's just like circling me. She's just like circling me over and over again. Oh, my babies. I always feel slightly delirious after I finish working. I am about to go to the gym. I have taken out some this curry chicken tenders for Ryan and then um, probably have him roast some potatoes and then some broccoli for dinner tonight, so that sounds tasty, pretty healthy too. Um, so yeah. <sighs> I just feel like this after work. Oh my god. I'm so tired. I'm super sore still from Tuesday. We did these like tricep push things and like some a bunch of other these deadlift things and just oh my goodness my whole back and my arms and my legs everything hurts so yeah but I feel like I feel like I'm changing just with how consistently I've been going lately um, yeah I, I feel it so that makes me happy. Puppies are barking. So I'm going to the gym. Ryan is going to cook dinner. I'll see you later. Bye. Ryan sure is productive when I'm gone. He made dinner with the broccoli. The chicken I'm guessing. Potatoes. Oh, potatoes. And, oh, here's the chicken. Here's the chicken. Huh, Gary? And he even made lunch. Yep. Pretty amazing husband. Mm-hmm. Pretty amazing. <laughs> I am for rent, uh, 1-800-RENT-A-HUSBAND.